In this Gimp Beginner's Guide, I'll show you how to create neon text. So first, I'll open a blank canvas. And then I click on the text tool in the toolbox to select it. And I'm going to change the font to MV Bowley. I'll change the size to 120 and then I click on my canvas and I type my text. Now I want my text layer to be the same size as my other layers. So I go to the Layers panel and I click on the Create a New Layer button at the bottom of it. I check that the new layer is going to be a transparency and I click OK. And now I go to that new layer in the Layers panel and I right click on it. And I come down and left click on Merge Down. And now when you look at my Layers panel, you'll see that my text layer and the new layer have merged together. So next I click on Filters in the menu bar and I come down to Alpha to Logo. I slide my cursor across and down and I click on Neon. Now if the dialog box does not appear on your screen, don't worry because it's probably underneath your project. You'll need to look for the button. And my button has appeared down in my taskbar. And when I click on it, the dialog box appears on top of the project. Now I'll accept the default settings and just click OK. And that's all there is to it. Now to create the oval shape, I'll click on the black layer in the Layers panel to make sure it's selected. And then I click on the Ellipse Select tool in the toolbox and just drag out an ellipse around the text. I then click on Select in the menu bar and come down and click on Invert. And then I press the Delete key on my keyboard. And to stop the marching ants and deselect the ellipse, I simply click on Select again and come down and click on None. Now I hope that made sense. But if you've got any problems or suggestions, please leave a comment.